Hey everybody, my name is Blake and I'm an operations and programs manager at a nonprofit. Today I'm going to be talking about Vimeo Pro, which I give a five star rating. And for more reviews just like this one, you can click below. So the pandemic started and we needed to figure out a way to move our programming into a virtual space really quickly. YouTube wasn't cutting it because we run workshops and we weren't able to do it on YouTube. The quality wasn't as good. We couldn't brand it to our nonprofit. Once we figured out that Vimeo Pro offered a number of different options to be able to host workshops in a module setting that could be directly connected to our content, everything changed. It helped us solve the pivot into the virtual stratosphere as a nonprofit and definitely helped us succeed moving forward. And now we're reintegrating into in-person programming as well as keeping our virtual programming model. And we're going to stick with Vimeo Pro. I mean, honestly, there's YouTube and then there's Vimeo. I realize that there may be a couple other different kind of video uh, streaming services, but it's definitely the one that's the best known. It has a really good rating across the boards <clears throat> on all different kinds of platforms. Um, and it just came really highly recommended to the organization. So it made the most sense to go with it. And then once we got in there, it we understood why. So for somebody who's not necessarily completely trained in video content production. It was a little overwhelming at first, not gonna lie. Once I started really digging in though, it started to make a lot more sense. It's very millennial in the way that they sort of walk you through a cutesy process with onboarding and showing you all the different components and variables of things that you can do with the software. But it did take me a minute. I don't consider myself to be a particularly thick person, but this one, it was a good one or two days before I really felt like I had it under my belt and was comfortable using it and turning it over to other employees to also be able to train on, on the platform. Just give yourself a couple days. If you're somebody like me who wasn't really aware of how complicated video production and or video content storage can be, I, uh, I needed to take a minute. So that honestly would be my biggest recommendation you can expect to learn the platform and then it becomes something, it's kind of like the New York City subway. Once you get it, you get it. Um, I would also prepare yourself to realize that there are certain things that the platform might bring out of your programming that you didn't know were necessarily there to begin with. It's a huge bonus that happened to us using the platform.